So hey guys, if you have rooted your device and installed TWRP recovery mode for using custom ROMs on your device, then you might have faced with a faulty issue and you cannot access the banking apps properly having the root access. In this video, we're gonna be flashing the original firmware for all Samsung devices. The process will be same for all devices but you have to download different firmware files depending on your device model. And after flashing the firmware, you will get back the Volti support and can access anything that the similar non rooted devices can do and obviously can get rid of battery draining issue. So let's get started. Most of the cases, custom ROMs cannot provide the Volti support. As you can see, that I have inserted GeoSIM in my device. Still there is no Volti and I am using the ASP extended room and in the settings you cannot find any setting related to the Volti. For flashing the firmware file open the download mode and there are two ways for opening the download mode. Firstly turn off your device and press the volume down key, home button and the power key simultaneously. And when this page will be opened, pressing again the volume up key, you will go to the download mode. And in the second method, open the TWRP recovery mode by pressing the home button, power key and the volume up key at the same time. When the recovery mode has been opened, tap on reboot and select download mode. And swipe the arrow right side to open download mode. As you can see the download mode has been opened, so let's get into the PC screen. First of all download these two zip files which are firmware file and Odin tool for flashing the device. Download link of the two zip files are given in the description box. Extract the files of the firmware and after extracting open the Odin tool as shown in the video. Now after opening the Odin tool, connect your device by a USB cable with your laptop or desktop. In the Odin tool you can see that the device is added. Now select the extract files in Odin tool. Select BL file on BL section, AP file on AP section and keep continue adding these files. And when the 4 files has been added, tap on start. The AP file will take large amount of time compared to the others, so you don't have to worry about this. As the profiles has been added on the Odin tool, you have to simply tap on the start. 
and Odin tool will start flashing your device. Now just hold on and your device will be flashed and rebooted automatically. Guys, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe this channel and hit the bell icon for notification updates. As you can see that the system has been flashed, now it will automatically reboot it. The first boot will take a large amount of time, so be patient. As you can see that the reboot process has been completed, let me just quickly set up the settings. And guys you can see that the voltage is working. I have used the device after flashing for a long days and it works properly and the device is running now in nougat version but you will get all the updates that the samsung developers provide so that's it for the video please subscribe this channel and guys i will see you in the next one bye